Hello, it's Gummy. In this video, I'm going to show you how to withdraw your money from Binance in a really quick and easy way. So, don't hesitate to like the video and subscribe. Let's go. So, if you too find it difficult to withdraw your money from Binance and put it into your bank account, for example, well, you came to the right video because I was exactly in your situation. So, whether you want to withdraw euros, Swiss francs, dollars or any other currency, don't worry, I have the solution for you in this video. So, I'm going to show you everything on my Binance mobile application but it's the same thing if you ever use Binance on your computer. So first thing is to open your Binance application like this. So, here we are on the Binance home screen, and you will have to go to your wallet which is normally at the bottom right of your Binance account on mobile. You click on it, and then you can see a little button called withdraw right here. You can then click on indent in the middle. You can also go directly to your spot wallet, and you will also see a withdraw button right here. You click on it and it will take you to the same page. Then, in the search bar, you will look for the currency with which you know you can be withdrawn. If you're lucky, normally you can withdraw directly with Binance. This is sometimes the case with euros, as you can see which are displayed. But typically, if you want to withdraw dollars, you see that normally, that doesn't work. There are no dollars displayed. These are only cryptos that you can see here. And then the same, Swiss francs don't work either. Really withdrawing currencies on Binance gets really complicated. But don't worry, I have the solution. So my solution is to use the Crypto Swissbor application. This will serve as an intermediary between Binance and the bank account from which we wish to withdraw our money. It's a very easy to use, very secure application that you can install very quickly. Registration is done in 5 minutes, and then you can directly withdraw your money from any bank account. So, if you don't yet have the Swissborg application installed on your mobile phone, you can find the link directly under the video, in the description of the video, or directly in the first comment pinned under the video. And then the cool thing is that by going through this link, you will unlock a bonus scratch ticket, which will allow you to win up to 100 euros, which you will also be able to withdraw from your bank account, so it's really all good for you. So just click on the link, you will be redirected to this page. You will have to click on accept, then accept the invitation like this. You will be redirected either to the Apple Store if you are on iOS, or to the Google Play Store if you are on Android. And then you put open, and then you can directly download the application. Once it is downloaded, you will simply have to open it. And then you will have to create your account, it takes 5 minutes as I told you. You will need to enter your name, first name, address, etc. It's really very simple. So it will be done in two stages. We will convert our cryptos into a single crypto, which we will then send to Swissborg, and then from Swissborg, we will be able to convert this crypto into euros, dollars, Swiss francs, whatever currency you want, which we will then be able to withdraw from our account banking. On Binance, so in your wallet, you will be able to see if you go to the spot tab, all your cryptos that you have on Binance, you can see I have quite a few, so lots of different ones. So you will have to send your cryptos from Binance to Swissborg. So normally all the big well-known cryptos are also available on Swissborg. So for example here the BNB which is the Binance crypto, normally if you go to the Swissborg application and you click on the deposit tab like here, you then click on crypto transfer, well you will normally be able to search in the BNB search bar and you see that the crypto is there. But if you ever search for the crypto on Swissborg and it is not displayed, well in this case you will simply have to convert your cryptos on Binance into another crypto which is available on Swissborg. So, let's imagine there is no this render crypto on Swissborg. So to transfer it to Swissborg, we will have to exchange this crypto for another crypto that is available on Swissborg, for example Solanas. So we're going to click at the bottom in the middle on trade, then we're going to click at the very top on the convert tab. Then, we will select the crypto that we wish to transform. For me, it will be render like here. And I'm going to put for example here Solana, so the only ones right here. Then, we indicate the amount of crypto that we want to change into Solana. Click on transaction overview. Next we have a recap. We put convert and normally it's done in a few seconds and that's it, I got some Solana. And now I will be able to send these Solana directly to Swissborg. So to do this we have to go back to the Swissborg application to obtain our Swissborg wallet address. So for this it's very simple. In the Swissborg application on the Portfolio tab, you will have to click on Deposit here on the left. Then, click at the bottom on Crypto Transfer. If you don't see the option, it's because you haven't yet verified your Swissborg account. You simply need to upload your identity document to Swissborg and the option should normally appear. So you click on Crypto Transfer. Then you write in the search bar at the top Solana like this. You click Solana. And then you will have a little pop-up from Swissborg which informs you that you can only send Solana via the Solana network. Don't worry, we will also be able to check on Binance that we are sending with the Solana network. So I was understood well. And then you can see right here at the bottom the Solana deposit address of our Swissbor account. This address will simply have to be copied so you can click on the little copy icon right here. Then you return to your Binance application. You click on withdrawal in your spot wallet here in the middle. 
So you indicate the crypto you want to withdraw. So it can be Solana like another crypto. So we are going to withdraw Solana. So I write Solana at the top, but it's the same if you ever withdraw another crypto, you just have to take the right address on Swissborg. For example, BNB cryptos will have another wallet address on Swissborg. You will have to copy and paste it and then paste it on Binance. There we have copied and pasted the Solana address, so it's all good, so we click on Solana. Then we click on send via crypto network. Then, here, we will be able to paste the Solana address of our Swissborg account. We put paste. Then, normally, the network is automatically selected. So, you see that it is indeed the Solana network. So, it's all good. And then, quite simply, you indicate the amount of Solana that you wish to transfer to Swissborg. Me, I'm going to use the maximum I have of Solana. Then, simply click on withdrawal, verify the transaction, click on confirm. So there you have it, the withdrawal is in progress. Then, we return to the Swissborg application, and we should normally receive a small notification within a few minutes, telling us that we have received the Sonanas that we transferred from Binance to our Swissborg account. And there you have it. In less than two minutes, I received notification that my Solanas had indeed arrived in my Swissborg account, as you can see right here. I think it was done in just a few minutes, so it's very fast, that's why I really like Swissborg. Next you will have to locate your Solanas. It's in your Swissborg portfolio. You go down until you find Solana or the crypto you sent to Swissborg. I click on Solana. Then, to transform these Solanas into the currency of your choice, so you click at the bottom on the green exchange button, then you click at the top and you search for the currency that interests you, and then click on add a currency. You will therefore be able to see all the currencies that are achievable on Swissborg. There is both the currency of South Africa, there is both the Singapore dollar, the American dollar, there is the Swedish crown, there is the human euro, the Polish currency, Norwegian currency, Israeli currency, Hungarian currency, Hong Kong currency, free sterling, Danish crown, Czech crown, Canadian dinars, and even Emirati dirhams. So there really is all the choice you want. If for example you want to withdraw Canadian dollars, you click on Canadian dollars. You then just have to indicate the amount of crypto that you wish to transform into your currency. So for example I'm going to put all my Solana in the currency. So then we click on next, and then you just have to confirm. You see the summary of costs, namely that the costs on Swissborg are very low compared to all the security and simplicity of the application. Plus it's ultra transparent, that's really cool. Then you click on confirm. The transaction is normally completed within seconds. So you get the currency of your country, and then you click on finish, and finally to withdraw this currency from your bank account, it is the same procedure for all the currencies of the countries, and you simply have to click at the bottom, write on withdraw, you will be able to add your bank account, so you click on it, you indicate the country of your bank, so if for example you live in Canada, well you put Canada, if you live, I don't know, I in Sweden, you put Sweden etc etc, so you really have all the countries available on Swiss board, you see that there are many, then you indicate your bank account information. So this will vary from one country to another, but normally you know very well what to indicate. Then, all you have to do is click on save account, and then, once your bank account is registered, then I show you with my Swiss bank account because I live in Switzerland, but it's the same for all the other bank accounts for all the other countries. So you click on the bank account that interests you. You put withdraw on this account. You indicate the amount of your currency that you wish to withdraw from your bank account. So I'm going to put in all my Swiss francs, and then simply, you just have to click on confirm. You will see that there will be a minimum service fee that will be charged. It's about 5 Swiss francs, 5 euros, 5 dollars. It's pretty much the same for all currencies. And then, simply click on confirm. You should receive your money in your bank account fairly quickly.